All right, Seamus, take you through slow motion, then make some comments. <clears throat> um, so you can't see this in slow motion, and it's hard to sync up in full speed. But I said this to you right away. Uh, I, I think overall, finding ways to move faster should be your, your number one goal because you do a lot of things very well. Um, I like the timing of your, the cocking of your arm. Uh, this is not common um, in a sense that good throwers do what you do and most kids don't do what you do um, as far as how late your hand gets up um, and the style that which you move with your upper half. So I would never change anything with your upper half. So everything's going to be from the ground up. Um, you do kick your leg out from under you very soon here, this left leg. Um, so I don't have any problem with your lift right here. Um, as long as while you go down with your lift, so as soon as you're going here, you need to be moving. Okay, and so all of this happened, okay, you had a lot of movement in your left leg before a lot of forward progress was made. Um, I am being picky, but like the distance between your knees right here goes much faster than this, the speed of your body. Okay, so we wouldn't want your knees to be apart like this until you've traveled down the mound a little bit more. That would be my biggest suggestion for you is find a way to move down the mound right here. So let me know if you have any questions. Hopefully this is helpful to see.